And tonight we are hearing from the sister of the victim, Raven Anderson. Two Works for You's Brady Hablai reached out to her today and you spoke with her earlier today. Brady, what did you find out? What did you learn about the family? Yeah, that's right, Karen. Um, and what a nightmare it has been for this family, of course. Raven said her sister was a mother other mothers aspired to be. Her children were all very close with one another and she loved them very much. A loving person. She's caring. She's kind. She's just all around good person. She's, she was a mother through and through. Raven Anderson says she's the sister of the victim who's now fighting for her life. She says the news came as a shock to her and her family. I was trying to stay strong um, for my sister. and She says her sister, a kind woman, was known as the fun one in the family, also known for a deep connection with her five children. My sister and her children were a great family. My sister was everything that uh, a mother should aspire to be. And the five children, all with high energy and loving to one another, spent much of their time painting, drawing, and playing together at the park. The sadness already stretching beyond Raven's family. I don't even know. I couldn't imagine what she went through. Megan Thompson, a friend of the family, has two young daughters of her own. She shares her thoughts after hearing the news of this morning's tragedy. I couldn't imagine life without my kids. Now she's reflecting on the love she has for her own children and her message to all mothers out there. I love them. I love them as much as I can. Hold them tighter. Protect them to the utmost. Now, Raven says uh, her sister is conscious, but in critical condition. Of course, we will keep you updated as we learn more. All right, Karen. Brady, thank you so much. Heartbreaking to hear from her sister. You know, she's just so upset. Understandably.